Prince Harry begged Meghan Markle to move to London as he was terrified of losing her just like his previous girlfriends, unearthed reports reveal. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex welcomed their new baby son, Archie Harrison Mountbatten-Windsor, last month, almost exactly a year after their fairy tale wedding. The former actress and the prince's relationship has moved incredibly quickly compared to other couples in the royal family. In July 2016, Meghan was strolling around London when she was randomly introduced to Harry by a mutual friend and they both claimed to have experienced love at first sight. At the time, they both had packed work schedules and lived in different countries so when they first started dating they had to fight against the odds and maintain a long-distance relationship. Despite these hindrances, love conquered all and the California native and her prince managed to see each other in either London or Toronto every two weeks. It was during this time that, according to a newly resurfaced report, love struck Harry begged Meghan to move in with him. In November 2016, only a month after the news of their relationship leaked, Phil Dampier wrote for the Daily Star, Friends say the royal Romeo is terrified of losing the 35-year-old American beauty now their six-month affair has been made public. A close pal said, Harry was hoping to keep it secret for as long as possible. His previous two girlfriends, Chelsea Davy and Cressida Bonas, couldn't cope with being in the spotlight and he is desperate not to lose Meghan. The good thing is that she is an actress who enjoys the limelight and she seems well able to deal with pressure. But it's not easy when you are on the other side of the pond. Hari understands she has work commitments, but he has asked her to move to London as soon as possible, maybe early next year, so that they can be together. Meghan reportedly waited until February 2017 before moving in with Prince Harry at Kensington Cottage. Nine months later, the couple was happily engaged. The two did not spend much time in their residence at Kensington Palace though, which they shared with Kate Middleton and Prince William as, ahead of the birth of their first newborn, the Sussexes moved into a new home called Frogmore Cottage. Meghan and Harry have recently faced criticism for spending £2.4 million of taxpayer money on renovations to their new home. Critics have called the figure particularly gulling at a time when public services are under financial pressure. However, a spokesman for the family said the building was already earmarked for renovation and the couple paid for off and grant on the couple's new official residence. He said, the property had not been the subject of work for some years and had already been earmarked for renovation in line with our responsibility to maintain the condition of the occupied royal palace's estate. The sovereign grant covered the work undertaken to turn the building into the official residence and home of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex.